Hello everybody, this is Lance here at TransWest Truck Trailer RV located in Belton, Missouri. Today I want to bring you this beautiful 2021, it's an Allegro Red 38KA. Absolutely gorgeous. I love the paint scheme on this thing. And uh, I do love the armless uh, awnings that we got going on. It was such a nice day, we thought we'd just bring them out for you so you get a nice little peek. So true to the Tiffin fashion, I love their badging. As we come up here, you can see that they they don't just paint this on, they actually machine these parts out. Just a very nice, uh, very nice touch to that. Gives it a little touch of luxury. On the front here, they do they, they did put on a clear bra, so it's gonna help protect the front uh, cap here from any rock chips. I do like what they do, uh, do with this Allegro, allowing the front to slide out like that, so it's easily accessible for technicians to get in there, do any work that needs to be done. Your windshield wiper fluid, easy to fill up. So, pretty nice little feature. Got a beautiful bonded windshield here. You don't have that big rubber bulb seal. Very nice. All right, coming around the corner, we got our little electrical bay. You got your push breakers here, so you don't have to worry about a fuse going out. If something pops, you just come out here and push it and easy, easily reset. You got the dual fueling station, so you can fill up on either side of the coach. All right, so coming down the way, you do got your hydraulic systems, which are on a slide tray. Your technician's gonna absolutely love you for this. You just pull that button, they can slide it out, they can get it worked on, and you're in and out. Got your Aqua Hot, it's a 250D, very nice. So big, beautiful pass-through storage all throughout the coach. You got some spare tiles in there for your floor when we get in there. So just a, a ton of storage for such a short little coach. As we come over here to the wet bay, uh, just as you can see, there's no carpet in there, no wood, nothing organic. So you don't have to worry about mold and uh, things rotting out. I think that was an intelligent design there as well. You do have a nice little uh, fresh water uh, cord reel here to store a hose, paper towel holder. Um, just very nice. I like how they water jetted all this out. So it doesn't matter if it's 10 years from now, this is never gonna wear out because that's been uh, water jetted. Now, as we start coming down here, let's take a look at the tire date. Looks like we got uh, 2020 for the DOTs. So pretty nice, you're not gonna have to worry about tires for a while, and they are Michelins. And you do have a, a, a nice uh, 50 foot, 50 amp cord here. You got your surge protection, so if you got some dirty power at an RV park, it is going to protect the electrical inside this coach. You've got your def fluid here, which is nice. And I like the fact that you've got a, uh, a gauge there so you don't have to guess where you're at on your levels. Just a nice little added storage here that's been rhino lined. Very nice. Coming around the corner. So if we just kind of step back here and take a look at this beautiful design on this rear cap. Uh, just very, very nicely done. And then you got your nice uh, badging here. It's been machined out, it's just not painted on. I love those little extra touches. You do got an air supply here. So uh, if you do have an Air Force One, it's nice to be able to have that air supply to your, to your tow vehicle. Coming around the corner here, we do have a nice, nice little extra storage area. Great areas here for your technicians to be able to uh, get some work done if for some reason your slide's not work, working that's your slide actuator right there so easy for them to get some work done chassis batteries and then looking at these rims these are going to be the all aluminum they're the AccuRide uh, all aluminum wheel there just very nice and then uh, this is actually kind of a nice little feature too I just like to be able to see you can visually see where the water is in this thing so uh, exterior sensors so you can get accurate readings all the time all right and then here you got a little service panel for your residential refrigerator inside so easily accessible for your technicians if they need to get to it you got some couple of disconnects down there for the house and your inverter and then you do have four uh, six volt batteries there that are on a slide tray so easily accessible along with uh, your LG TV, right? Life is good with your sound bar just above. And you do have a couple of USB ports up there. So just an overall nice 
beautiful coach. All right, guys, well, that does it for this beautiful coach on the outside. Let's uh, take a step back, take a look at this thing. It's just absolutely gorgeous. And you notice, too, just how big this window is here, uh, just above the kitchen. This, uh, and we'll actually take a look at that when we get inside. Really quite nice. All right, well, let's go take a look and see what we've got going on inside. All right, guys, well, welcome to, the, to this beautiful 2021 Allegro Red 38KA. Today we're gonna to start up here in the cockpit and uh, it's just an absolutely gorgeous design. I like how they kind of brought this part of the dash more closer to the driver so it's a little bit more ergonomically correct. It's got that dual monitor system. You got your side cameras left and right, which is quite nice. It does come with navigation as well uh, here on this monitor. We don't need that on anymore. But And then up here, what I like right here is uh, a nice easy access panel. Instead of having to tear the whole dash apart to maybe fix something here with the monitors, uh, you can get easy access right here into the dash, which is quite nice. Um, let's see, we got your step cover right here. I'm gonna actually have you just take a quick peek over there. This is actually a pretty neat little design. So when this thing comes out, you're gonna notice that it raises up and then it comes flush. So that adds to the comfort of the passenger over here so that they can have a nice flush floor over there. Now this is going to be the, the new style of Freightliner chassis. A lot of the controls are going to be right here on the steering wheel. And uh, so you've got your cruise control set up in here, your, uh, your wireless phone. So if you want to uh, answer your phone calls or hang up, it can all be done right here on the steering wheel. But you're also your drive functions, your engine brake, all that is going to be right here. So uh, you just click that forward for drive, that's neutral, reverse, uh, quite nice, easy access. Um, you don't have to take your eyes off of the road and look for all that over here. It's just easily accessible right there. Um, your windshield wipers and all that's gonna be on this side of the steering wheel. Now this is gonna have tilt function and it will have telescoping as well. So you can raise it up, bring it down. So uh, pretty nice features there as well. All right, so this coach currently has about 12,895 miles on it. So we are just getting started. You got that beautiful digital dash up there. I love that. Um, a lot of times you don't get digital dash in this level of coach. And if I haven't mentioned it already, with the 360 horsepower motor that this thing's got in it, it's going to be a breeze getting up there and climbing them hills. Now, slide control functions on this motorhome are typically on a panel, which it does. There's multiple ways to bring slides in and out on this coach. One is going to be the buttons right here on the side of the chair. So I can sit here, face my slides, and I can kind of uh, make sure that we're not crunching cabinet doors or, you know, maybe something is in the way. Maybe a favorite pet. We want to make sure that they're safe. But um, these chairs do turn around. We'll, we'll go do this real quick. You just unhook this. Now, what makes that really nice is a lot of times when you're trying to turn a chair around, the seat belt gets hung up and it makes it hard to turn this chair. But as you can see, it was pretty easy just by unhooking the seat belt. So pretty nice feature. Beautiful dinette, you got your solid surface countertops. You do have an outlet. That thing's got a lot of outlets. You got an outlet here, 110. You got a 110 there as well, along with USB ports. You got a lot of nice overhead storage. And I love the fact that they've actually put cabinets. Uh, wherever there was wall space, you can see that they've got storage. So you're not gonna be lacking storage, even though this is gonna be a shorter coach. You definitely got plenty of cabinet space. Now coming into the kitchen, you're gonna see that we do have a really nice uh, dishwasher. We do have the Whirlpool uh, convection microwave oven. You do have a nice little extension here. Let me just un unlock it. So if you need a little extra counter space, some really nice deep drawers here. Yeah. I think you're going to be hurting for space on this guy. I like the fact that you've got a, a power supply here, a couple of USB ports with some 110, and uh, you can make all that go away if you want. 
I like the fact that it's hinged. It can settle here, or you can pull those pins and you can pull it off if you'd like. You got your induction cooktop. You got the dual stainless steel sink. You got your gooseneck faucet. And actually, let's go ahead and close. Close the stove so you can get a better view of this beautiful kitchen window. Really quite nice. Look at that. Just a great way to keep in touch with family and friends. You can see all the activity that's going on over there. Um, now as we come down this way you're gonna see that we do have a nice uh, LG refrigerator and it is absolutely huge. Just look at all that space. Now we just got this thing in so we got, we still have to go through this, go through the systems, make sure your refrigerator, your air conditioner, furnace, hot water heater, things like that are working, which uh, we do here at TransWest. We make sure your coach is standing tall before we deliver it. Now, just across from the kitchen, you got this beautiful couch, really nice fireplace. Now this is gonna be an electric fireplace, so you can use it just for the uh, ambiance or it'll actually put out heat as well. Got a nice sound bar here below your LG TV. Got that beautiful accent lighting going on around the TV. Now, one of the nice things about this coach, now this will make into a bed. So you got your nice high to bed here. This will sleep two adults. This breaks down into a bed as well. So you can sleep a little kiddo there. And then coming into here, one of the things that I really like about this coach is you've got this extra sleeping here. So this can be either bunks or you can pull this up out of the way and then you'll notice the closet rod here you can convert this into a closet or have a bunk so it really is you can just have it your way got a couple of nice little storage drawers here down below again this this coach is all about storage we do have a little control central panel here so let's just start here at the home. You got a way to control your lights. You can turn your aqua hot system on here. You can see what your temperature is here in the different zones. You can uh, see where your voltage is here on your batteries. You can control lights, temperature here. If it's really hot and you just want to come in here and open up all the different vents, you can come in here and just start pumping out the, the hot air. And then you've got all your different slide controls here as well, not just on the chairs. Now this is gonna be another nice little area where you can, let's say uh, your wireless settings, uh, tie it through your phone. Um, you can control the color of the screen. Uh, you can have it turn off automatically to where you have to touch it before it turns on. That way it's not disturbing the kiddos as they're sleeping. All right, guys. Now just below here, you notice it does have the central vac. So nice little feature. And then in here, this is going to be the half bath, perfectly located just across from the bunk area. So really nice little area here for guests. And then we come in here to the master bedroom. Got a beautiful king bed here with a ceiling fan. Does have this really nice soft touch ceiling here. It really does help dampen the noise, add a little extra insulation. You've got some really nice extra cabinets here that are lit up. So as soon as you open the door here, it just automatically turns the light on and off for you. It's got some beautiful drawers down here. And whenever you see a louver like uh, front like this on one of your cabinet doors, typically it's gonna be where your entertainment is. It's gonna have the ability to let air flow in there and keep, keep your different electronics cool. Got another LG TV here. All right. So on both sides of the bed, you're going to notice that they do have uh, power on both sides of the bed. You do have a little bit of storage, just a little bit of cabinet door storage there, a little area where you can set up maybe a water bottle, um, uh, another outlet here. So 110 outlets on both sides, along with your USB ports and just phenomenal deep storage. Just a great place. I mean, this is nice and deep. This is a big pillow, right? And it, all this stuff can fit in there, no problem. So just a great area to uh, store your items. All right, guys, so coming in here to the bathroom, this thing is gonna be just absolutely nice. 
if you just want to get in here and soak what I do like now I'm about six foot 260 pounds I'm able to sit here I'm able to be able to be relaxed a lot of times you'll notice these seats are right here up against the hardware so it's nice to be able to just lean in here and I don't have nothing up against my back so just really nice you got a nice little grab bar right here so if you need need that little help up that's quite nice got some nice extra storage here medicine cabinet space and then you do have a little extra pull out storage there let's check out what we got here below great storage even a little room for a little tiny garbage can how about that all right guys and then just on this side we got our stackable splendid washer and dryer just an absolutely beautiful coach porcelain toilets all right guys well that does it for this coach we're going to give you a sneak peek also because we've we covered the two bunks we covered the uh the hide -a bed here we also covered the bunk but it also has an overhead bunk as well which we haven't covered so let's take a quick peek at that before we let you go just unlatch it there this thing just pulls down so really this coach you can really sleep like a small village in this thing all right guys well that does it for the tour here of this 2021 allegro red if you guys have any questions i sure would love to help you my name is lance here at trans west in belton missouri and my phone number is 208-290-5750 i look forward to hearing from you all right guys so before we let you go as we were putting this coach away we noticed as we brought the slides in we wanted to give you a little peek at what this looked like with all the slides closed and it was just amazing and it was worth taking the extra time here to show you because uh, I mean I'm a pretty decent sized guy right I'm gifted here in the midsection but lots of room here to get in and out the bathrooms fully accessible the refrigerator is fully accessible um, you've got like three seat belts here you got two there two in the front so I mean you can sleep a small village you can safely seat a small village so a lot of room in here for everybody to kind of get up and do things and get to the restroom if you need to so anyway all right guys so just keep in mind if you have any questions i'd love to help you again lance here at trans west 208-290-5750 i look forward to hearing from you